I'm Dylan Black. His name is Michael McNaught. He is the founder and the CEO of RVEasy.com. Michael, how are you? Good, yourself? Welcome back to the show. We've had you on in the past. And uh, okay, so when exactly did RVEasy.com get launched? Uh, so our VZ started, uh, we launched the website in August of last year. Uh, re really the idea was born a, a couple of years ago and uh, it, we finally came to fruition in August. Okay, so tell us exactly what it is. So our VZ is, uh, you know, very simply put, is an Airbnb for RVs. Okay. So that, it, that really helps to explain the concept. So what it is is a platform, a way for people to offset some of the cost of ownership by renting out their RV, so either a motorhome or trailer, uh, when they're not using them. Okay. Uh, say the name of the company one more time. And RVZ, RVEZ, RVZ, we get both. Okay, because I like that, because that's less work for me. Because like yeah. I'm a lazy guy by, by nature, so if it's RVZ, or it could be RV easy. It, it really works both ways. <laughs> I do like that. And then, you know, the uh, kind of the, the, the statistic is that, uh, you know, 11 months out of the year, these RVs sit idle. Mm -hmm. And, uh, you know, why, why not offset some of those costs of ownership and say, you know, share that experience with others? Which is incredible. So are we talking uh, basically just the Ottawa area? Like how far is this, this spread out? So we, uh, we have RVs located all across Canada. Uh, we have over 200 RVs currently on the site. Across um, Canada? Across Canada. Wonderful. Yeah. Um, you know, so even as an RV owner, we have a lot of renters that rather than taking their own RV, they'll fly to a location and they'll be able to rent from somebody locally. That's and cool. it's typically 40 to 50% cheaper than kind of traditional rental options. Okay. So if you want to get signed up, if you have an RV and you want to be part of RVZ, uh, how would you, like, what are the criteria? So it's a, it's a very simple process. It takes about five minutes, uh, kind of similar to your classified ad where you're going to upload some pictures, a description. Uh, you as the owner, you decide on your pricing. Um, and then about five minutes, you click the, the publish button and your RV is available to rent on the community. Wow. Okay, that's, that's pretty exceptional. Yeah, it, it, it's great. And, and one of the really big things for us uh, ha has been recently, we just signed kind of a, an industry first insurance deal. Uh, for us, that was the, 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 our biggest concern uh, was developing an insurance product uh, for Canadians. Mm -hmm. You know, we, we learned pretty quickly that, that not all insurance is created equally. And so we, we went out there and we, uh, we, we joined with, uh, with Aon and Intact mm -hmm. and worked with the same guys that developed the insurance for Uber. And it took wow. about 12 months, but we, we now have a full insurance coverage for what's rented on our website. Well, congratulations on that. Uh, thank you. Okay. And you did something very cool as well in uh, the month of uh, June. Um, uh, tell us about uh, what you did for a Syrian uh, refugee family. Um, so a bit of background, uh, my background, I'm a police officer mm -hmm. uh, and my business partner is a reservist who served in Afghanistan. Uh, so when we launched the company, we really wanted to do something unique and special for Canada's 150th. And just with our, with our background and seeing some of the struggles that a lot of new Canadians have coming to our country, uh, we wanted to reach out and provide them with an experience of, of a pastime that's, you know, uh, that, that's uh, so common to so many Canadians. So what we did is we did a, a four-day RV trip uh, with the Two Bay family. Mm -hmm. And uh, we, we started here in Ottawa on Parliament Hill. Uh, went down to Kingston, uh, did the, a tour of Old Fort Henry, uh, went to Sandbanks for a day, uh, spent a day at Canada's Wonderland, and then finished it off in Algonquin Park. Oh, that's wonderful. So, so how many days in total did you, did you spend? It, it was a four-day four trip. Four-day trip. Did, did a little bit of everything. Look uh, how happy they are in these pictures as well. Had a close encounter with a bear. We, did you uh, really? We time on the beach. What happened yeah, with the bear? <laughs> uh, he just happened to be in the same place that we were. And, uh, okay, welcome he, to he, Canada, right? Yeah, he let us know when he was there. <laughs> That's something. So that really is amazing, and it really warms the heart to see this pic these pictures, right, of, of how this, this, uh, this family came over, and, and obviously a scary time for them. And you definitely made things beautiful for them. So congratulations on that. Uh, thank you. And you know, and we like th these are going to be lifelong friends. Like that, this family uh, w is, is unbelievable. They they took everything in, and uh, I don't know where they had the energy to do it because I, I was pretty exhausted by the end of the trip. Yeah. Um, you know, but they they loved it. And now that they've seen Ontario, they want to see the rest of Canada, and it, it, it's just a great way of doing that yeah. is in an RV, which they can do by going to rvz.com. Yeah, that's right. right. They can. And then I can see all of Canada. Yeah, that was absolutely. like my little pitch for you, okay? Uh, how did you actually get to choose this family? How did you meet the family? So we, uh, when we came up with that idea that we wanted to provide this trip to a local family, uh, we reached out to the community, to a lot of the, the, the sponsors that have done private sponsorships. Mm -hmm. um, and we were introduced to the Two Bay family and uh, they, they were really excited and really, really into the whole idea. So uh, 
uh, you know, they, they were the ones that ended up getting chosen, and yeah, uh, yeah we, had a, we had a blast. That's wonderful. Uh, you obviously have a love for RVs yourself. I mean, growing up as a kid, like some of your um, nicest memories must be touring around or camping about. Yeah, my, my background, I spent my entire youth as a, uh, a canoe guide in northern Ontario. Oh, wow. So I spent my summers uh, fishing and canoeing in Algonquin Park and, and getting paid for it, yeah. <laughs> which was yeah. the, the best part. Uh, so it's always been a big part of my life. And uh, so when I bought my motorhome for my family, uh, we, we used it, but it was that four weeks out of the year, that family vacation that we had. And the other 11 months, this expensive asset is sitting in the driveway. Mm -hmm. So it just, uh, you know, the, the business mind in me said, uh, you know, m maybe I can share this with others and offset some of the costs. Mm -hmm. And I think this is wonderful because not only are you helping out owners, you're helping out many families. Uh, helping out with their costs as well. And, and, and traditionally, renting from a, a big fleet company or the ones you see down the road with the, the names plastered all over them, uh, it's just out of reach to the everyday Canadian. It's not affordable. That's uh, where we're 40 to 50% less expensive. And what we want to do is provide uh, an opportunity to every Canadian to get into the RV industry. Michael McNaught, founder and CEO of RVZ.com. Go there and uh, check it out. Thank you very much for being here with us today. Thank you. And thank you. Take care.